people equality of, of opportunity, that's fine. It's not only fine, it's eminently desirable for everyone, for individuals and for society. But still women aren't going to make it, that's what you're really it saying. It depends on your measurement techniques. They're doing just fine in medicine. In fact, there are far more female physicians than there are male physicians. There are, there are lots, of, uh, lots of disciplines that are absolutely dominated by women. Many, many disciplines. And they're doing great. Gender equality a myth in your view? Is that something that's just never going to happen? It depends on what you mean by equality. You know, Being if you mean fairly, men and women. Getting the same opportunities. Fairly. People, we could get to a point where people were treated fairly or more fairly. I mean, people are treated pretty fairly in Western culture already, but we can well, They're really that. not though, are they? I mean, otherwise, well, why would there only be seven women running FTSE 100 companies in the UK? Why why would there still be a pay gap, which we've oh, discussed well, as easy, like, easy Why are women at the BBC question. saying that they're getting paid illegally less than men to do the same job? Well, let, That's not fair, well, is let's it? Let's go to the first question. They're, well, those are complicated questions. Seven, seven women, re repeat that one. There's seven women seven. running the top FTSE 100 companies in the UK. Okay. Well, the I first, mean, the first question might be, um, why would you want to do that? Why would a man, man want to do it? I well, mean, there's a lot are, of money, certain, it's an interesting job. There's a job, certain you know? number of, of men, although not that many, who are perfectly willing to sacrifice virtually all of their life to the pursuit of a high-end career. So they'll work. These are men that are very intelligent. They're usually very, very conscientious. They're very driven. They're very high energy. They're very healthy. And they're willing to work 70 or 80 hours a week, non-stop, specialized, at one thing to get to the top. So you're saying women are just more sensible. They don't want that to be nice. Well, I'm saying that's part of it, definitely. And so I work so you, for... So you don't think there are barriers in their way that prevent them getting to the top oh, of those Oh, there are companies? some barriers, yeah. Like, other, like men, for example. I mean, to get to the top of any organization is an incredibly competitive enterprise. And the men that you're competing with are simply not going to roll over and say, please take the position. So it's, let me come back to my question. It's absolute all-out warfare. Is gender equality a myth? I, I don't know what you mean by the question. Men and women aren't the same, and they won't be the same. That doesn't mean they can't be treated fairly. Is gender equality desirable? If it means equality of outcome, then almost certainly it's undesirable. That's already been demonstrated in Scandinavia. Because in Scandinavia... What do you mean by that? Equality of outcome is undesirable. Well, men and women won't sort themselves into the same categories if you leave them alone to do it off their own accord. I've already seen that in Scandinavia. It's 20 to so, 1 female nurses to male, something like that. It might not be quite that extreme. And approximately the same male engineers to female engineers. And that's a consequence of the free choice of men and women in the societies that have gone farther than any other societies to make gender e equality the purpose of the law. Those are ineradicable differences. You can eradicate them with tremendous social pressure and tyranny. But if you leave men and women to make their own choices, you will not get equal outcomes. Right, so you're saying that anyone who believes in equality, whether you call them feminists, call them whatever you want to call them, should basically give up because it ain't going to happen. Only if they're aiming at equality of outcome. So you're saying give people equality of, of opportunity, that's fine. It's not only fine, it's eminently desirable for everyone, for individuals and for society. But still women aren't going to make it, that's what you're really it saying. It depends on your measurement techniques. They're doing just fine in medicine. In fact, there are far more female physicians than there are male physicians. There are, there are lots, of, uh, lots of disciplines that are absolutely dominated by women. Many, many disciplines. And they're doing great.